What's up guys, welcome to new Unreal Engine 5 tutorial today I am going to show you how to push objects in Unreal Engine 5 that you're basically facing It's gonna be very easy for you to follow, so let's get started Alright, so the first thing that I'm going to do is go into the third person character blueprint So let's open up third person blueprints, open up the third person character blueprint And then here what I'm going to do is go ahead and just when I press, for example, the left mouse button and I'm going to be pushing the object that I have in front so for that I'm going to be creating a sphere trace channel and this will be an invisible kind of line trace that will go from one point to another in my case from my player's camera forward and if there's any object I will push it so let's go ahead and just get the uh, camera and you say the get world location and that's where our line trace or in this case sphere trace because it will be more of a sphere uh, will start and then I can just get the world rotation and from that just get the forward vector which is where we are looking at and just time this by a value in this case it will be how much we want to go forward so let's right click go to float and put around uh, 500 so any objects uh, in 500 you know of distance I can go ahead and push them let's go ahead and just add these two vectors together and that will be our end point now for radius put something as 15 we can play it down and then just put this to four duration so we can preview this fear trace okay so now if I save and go back and press play as you can see when I let click all uh, this you know gonna fear trace is created so any object that will go from my camera and just in front of me I'll be able to push it so I want to just increase this by a bit, so maybe instead of 500, let's put 700 just to make sure. And now if we have detected something, what we'll do is push that object. So we can just get the out hit and just break it. So we'll have all the parameters about the object that we have just hit it. In this case, we want to get the hit actor because yeah, that's what we want. And just add a force, okay? Uh, now we cannot directly do it from here, as you can see, uh, because we don't know what type of actor it is and not all. We cannot push all actors. Uh, if we open up, we have more options here, but it's not always like that. Uh, we can also try to add impulse, but again, it doesn't appear. Uh, and if we go to launch character, we do have that option. Actually, we don't have that option too. So it depends on what type of actor. In this case, what I want to do is just push any actor at all, pretty much. Um, in my case, let's go ahead and just select this kind of cubes. So what I am going to do is go ahead and click this button to just make them a blueprint and I can just go ahead and select static mesh actor in this case this will be the BP underscore cubes okay so now let's just go ahead and select this this will create a blueprint you can see they have similar physics on and everything like that let's go back to here and I want to go ahead and just cast to BP cubes so if the object that I want to push is the cube I just want to go ahead and add some force in this case we have a lot of uh, options and it will just be the static mesh position so now from here i can just go ahead and specify how much force do we want in my case i want to push it where my camera is looking so let's just get the camera uh full camera just get the world rotation just like we did before and just get the forward vector so we can know where we are right now uh, looking at and from here we just want to multiply this value by right clicking at a float and in this case it has to be some big values maybe like 10,000 okay uh, we're gonna go ahead and plug this there I put 10,000 or 100,000 okay I did put 100,000 so you can just put 100,000 too you'll see now if we go it will not happen and this is because we have to make sure that we have accelerate uh, change clicked on and now as you can see we'll be able to push the cube what we want which looks pretty cool so that's it for this throw if you enjoyed it I really appreciate it if you like the video and subscribe to my channel there are lots of unreal engine throws you can get the profiles on my patreon on youtube members uh join my subscriber follow me on my socials now yes boss well, said bye bye <laughs>